Hey guys and welcome to this new video. Oh, so for today I've got Sola's uh, debut album Inside Out to open. I have all three versions, and I got them from uh, Starship Square. So I have uh, the like set pubs because I think it was different pubs if you got like the albums and bums by themselves or in a full set of like three. So yeah, uh, I just got all the FD versions since that's what I wanted. So yeah, we have. Uh, this one, which I guess these are for the photo book versions because both are uh, sideways and this double sided one, which I guess goes with the uh, envelope version. So yeah, a very cute, since she's not like my bias, I'm not gonna fully collect her pubs or anything, just I wanted to get them with pubs and Starship Square seemed like the easiest bet. So okay, let's go with the photo books. Should have looked up if these had uh, have names before I started, but I didn't. Anyways, I don't know if they have names or not. So you have like a double, like kind of cover like this, and there's like an unfocused uh, picture there. Ooh, and a full size, very pretty picture of so that there. But yeah, anyways, okay. I was trying to see if there was a picture in the back, but it's the cd so uh okay i was trying to find the photo card so let's look at the photo book but yeah anyways so our first uh ujo Sonana member that got a solo our girl sola the oldest i don't know if that's a coincidence that she got uh her soul first and she's the oldest but anyways she freaking killed it <laughs> i freaking love without you it's so freaking good and yeah she's been uh she's been killing it <laughs> i don't think there's a choreo for the dance because i've seen like some of her performance on music show and yeah she, she just seems to like be singing i don't think there's a choreo but it's not very a song like that is more um, very uh, choreo focused i guess girl you look so freaking good in that outfit <laughs> but yeah anyways i feel like it very much suits her i was watching a reaction channel and they kind of said that um they felt like it sounded a bit western and i kind of agree they, they compared it to like uh indie pop western artist and yeah if you know uh the artist fletcher they compared it to something that Fletcher would release, and I agree. <laughs> and I love Fletcher, so yeah. She looks so good. And yeah, she's been doing a lot of TikTok challenges with a lot of people. She actually did one with uh, Liu Jin, which that was for me. Like, they're both for the girls, and they're both, no, they're not both my biases, but um, Liu Jin is my bias. <laughs> So yeah, also both the B-sides are very good. I think out of them, my favorite it's, is Let's Talk. I really like that song. But yeah, anyways, her album is so good. It's just a single album. Wish I would have, we would have gotten more, but it's more than nothing. <laughs> uh, Cause like, we haven't gotten a, um, Oh, she didn't come back in a very long time, so I'm happy that she could at least uh, get a solo. And although I doubt we're gonna get a full group comeback soon, I hope that they can do maybe unit stuff or something. But yeah, there's also no girl. Oh, she's credited in the lyrics and composing for that. I'll have to look if she did some uh, work on the other songs too. But yeah. I would very much like a uh, the black comeback. That would be my dream. I'm not sure if we could get a Chokomi comeback since Luda left the company. She hasn't like technically left the group, I think. But yeah, it would be easier to get a the black comeback since um, all the members are still in the company. No spine, Starship, do better. <laughs> but anyways. So, okay, let's look at my inclusions. So, first up, there's a poster. I'm not sure if it's random, but here she is. So freaking good. I love her haircut. It's like kind of that 
a wolf cut thing and yeah we got this polaroid i think there's six different polaroids maybe question mark but you got that one and this photo card oh she looks so good there's also quite a lot of different photo cards i don't remember if it's like six or ten it's it's quite a bit don't think i'm gonna collect all the photo cards i might collect a few i'll see what they look like i haven't i haven't looked at any templates or anything so i don't even know what they look like <laughs> but yeah so we got that photo card and yeah that was it for the first uh copy so let's go through the next one which looks like there's very pretty concepts oh okay the four cards are uh, version specific maybe so maybe there's like six for each version or something but yeah, so here's the picture inside of this one it's a very uh, dreamy concept she looks like she just got out, out of bed <laughs> but yeah she's so pretty she's yeah she's she's the moment she's she's sola <laughs> but yeah i don't know if she did any like promotion on like variety show or anything for this comeback but i'm starving in terms of uju content so i'll have to look into it because if she did i will be watching it so she did also participate in the lyrics for the title track. That's nice. We love composer Sola. Ooh, I don't know why, but this is giving me like 50s vibe or like 70s. <laughs> There's lyrics. I didn't point that out before, but yeah. There's some lyrics sprinkled. That's that's questionable, girl. What are you doing? What are you doing with a candle? These pictures are very thin. It's easy to miss one. But yeah. She is so pretty. <laughs> I just keep saying that. But uh, okay, so let's talk. Seems like it's the only song she didn't uh, write lyrics for. No, I'm blind. She did. She's there. She. So she. Uh, participated in, in uh, composing and writing lyrics for all the songs. We love that. So, can we have another concept? There's a lot of different concepts. I just unboxed uh, Etsy's album and I was complaining about all there wasn't a lot of different concepts. But yes, yeah, Starship understood something here. <laughs> I guess you have to do a lot of concept for a solo uh, album since there's only one member. If you just do like a few concepts, it could get boring. There's so many, just only a few like poses you can do after a while. But yeah, so that was this version. Let's look at the uh, CD. I thought it was white because of like that sheet thing. It looked very white. <laughs> but yeah, so okay. Inclusion. So poster, like I said, I'm not sure if these are random. They might not be since it seems to be the uh, like concept of the photo book they're in. So yeah. And the Polaroid. Don't know if it's a coincidence, but we got a concept that was in this photo book. And photo card. I don't know if I've ever actually like look at her signature, but that's cute with like these three little dots. I don't think uh does the does they usually have signature on the back? I don't think they do. That's why I don't think I've seen their signature that much. But yes, yeah, so for a card we got this one. So cute with the blue sweater. So yeah, I think uh, the photo card set are different in between the versions. Okay, so I have one more version to go through, and I want to uh, praise uh, Starship on this one because this is unique packaging it's original we love to see it i love when um company do unique packaging for groups and yeah they they know their audience they know like uh, us collectors like they were like here you go have an envelope it's like you got the mail <laughs> and it's very much like an envelope like they'll like boxing when there's the uh, address written sometimes and stuff 
so cute let me try and get this off smoothly okay that was perfect no residue whatsoever <laughs> so oh it's a mini cd okay that's that's cool so let's see what we have so that's like the envelope portion like the letter i guess so you have the credits and the lyrics with some little pictures sprinkled in there. Uh, then you have the uh, little mini CD, so freaking cute. Uh, okay, there's this thing with a photo card stuck, tucked in there. So okay, here's a little photo book. That's like that they still included um, some of some pictures. Are these the same pictures as the standard version? No, I don't think they're they are. They're like the same concept, but I think they're different pictures. So that's nice. Uh, then you have a film strip. I'm not sure if it's uh, random, but we get this one. And for the cards, I don't remember how many there is. It might be like three or something for this version i'm not sure i should have looked at the inclusions before i filmed this but yes we get this one. Oh, so pretty yeah i might try to collect maybe like three more full cards because like in between those and the pubs that means that i would have a full page and it would look good but yeah anyways so that was it for this unboxing i hope you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you in my next video bye <music>